my friend. It's so very good to see you again. Master Cordova. It's an honor. I... I never thought I'd meet you in person. The honor is mine, Cal. Sears told me everything. You have demonstrated great bravery and wisdom in the face of overwhelming adversity. You chose well? Well, <laughs> I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> The Empire has claimed the ruins. You'll have to find another rendezvous point. Unfortunate. But at least the storm covered your tracks. Come. Come, let me escort you inside. Just keep trying. It's not like Brother Armai has to break contact. Cal Kestis. Welcome to Jeddah. I knew the storm wouldn't deter you. You're rebuilding the temple archives. Yeah, we're trying. As long as this knowledge remains, the legacy of the Jedi survives. It's incredible. Mm -hmm. But something tells me there's more to this than just hollow books. Yes. We're a part of a network known as the Hidden Path. We provide safe passage and new identities to those who have been persecuted by the Empire. Hunted by the Empire, like... like Jedi survivors? Very few of us remain. But yes, and Force sensitives, and those who help them. Why didn't you tell me? You never asked. Besides, I hear you've been busy making yourself the Empire's most wanted. I wanted to prove to the galaxy that the Empire is an invulnerable. That you can resist. That you have to fight if things are gonna get better. But then they just listen to the propaganda and they pretend they're free anyways. Hmm. Chose a hard path. And it hasn't made a difference. Well, while the Empire's trained its eyes on you, we've been able to build the network, find allies, and save lives. When you left, uh, you'd just given up. I was wrong. Cal, you were just a child when they sent you off to war. You know, there was a time when I remember that the Jedi were more than just weapons. But we both have our roles to play in this struggle. Yeah, but that's why I'm here. Seer. Well, you get a load of this! Hey, Seer. You can't say it ain't short of personality, <laughs> but kind of creepy, though. Yeah, well, it's good to see you two agree. <laughs> <laughs> well, oh, hello, uh, BD. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> so, how was your time in the desert? The storm covered our tracks, but the Empire destroyed one of your speeders. It's a small price to pay for everybody's safe arrival. And who's this? This is Bodokuna. He's a friend. It's so nice to finally meet you. Uh, this hunk of trouble! <laughs> hey! We're all together! Huh? Yes. Now, what brings you all to Jeddah? We're searching for a lost planet. Tantalor, you ever heard of it? It's on the other side of a deadly nebula called the Kobo Abyss. Well, our archives are far from complete, but I'm sure Master Cordova's up to the task. With pleasure. The trouble is, we're not the only ones looking for this place. I knew this was sounding too easy. Guy's name is Dagon Gera. He was a Jedi. Now he leads a band of raiders on the Outer Rim. There's an old temple there. Dagon intends to reclaim it. 
a Jedi temple out of the reach of the Empire could mean that there's information there that we don't have in the archive. I believe I have something. <laughs> oh, you're too kind, BD. <laughs> I'll start with the bad news. Oh, boy. This guy knows his audience. <sighs> I found no information related to crossing the Kobo Abyss. However, I found two mentions of this Dagon Gera. He had a retreat on Kobo. And records show him frequently visiting a laboratory on its moon. Okay, we'll check him out. If you find anything, bring it to me. I am happy to assist further. Thank you. Both of you. You're welcome, Cal. I hope you find what you're searching for. May the Force be with you. And with you.